Greetings, Zachariah. I think it's time I answered Victor's constant attacks. I'm gonna need help, though. That's what family is for, Zachariah. We are family. United by the mutual suffering inflicted by Victor. His time to pay for all he's done has come. We are united in that. Is. There's the well we talked about. And here's the pump. It's a total wreck. I could fix it up, but I'd need the materials. Got another solution? I do know where we can grab the spares. City generators in Ophir and Noctis. It'll piss a lot of people off, but only thing I can think of. Up to you.
Scott, thanks for coming. Please have a seat. I'm just trying to understand something. Ah, a scientific query. Let us engage. No, not quite. I just wanted to understand what you were doing with Alan under that shadow path. A couple mutants saw you and said you told Alan that you knew what he was, and that you could do... Of course, the jackass didn't give a damn. All he wanted to know was where we were. But what the hell were you trying to do, Scott? Do? I wasn't doing. I simply... I was doing something, but not what... There are opportunities in life. He might have become an ally, a great technomancer. Even if you're not friends, he could... I was... a mistake. Scott, you gotta be straight with me. Those guys are ready to kill you over this. Straight? Like an arrow? Yes, like a line. The shortest point between... I am sorry you find yourself on the run. I, I, I had hope. You would reconcile with abundance. One of them to embrace you back. All I want to know is why you told him you knew what he was. I... Perhaps you've had a hunch, or mm, caught wind from wherever such winds come from, but I now know. Technomancy stems from mutation, and an intentionally created mutation, what the settlers called gene therapy. We, of course, refrain from such mm, potential pollution of real humans, and just the knowledge of such things, well, would unsettle most make things very different. My hope, though, was that such knowledge might scare Alan into supporting your cause. You see? And what was this ability that you were talking about? Just whimsy. A daydream, perhaps. Trying to remind him of my skills. Medical. Scientific. I yearn to return to Abundant Zachariah. It is my mother. The idea of being discarded into a lawless city. If he remembered my worth, perhaps I thought he might help me return and bring you too. I don't know what the hell you were thinking, Scott, but what's done is done. Let's get out of here. Zachariah, what can I do for you? I need allies to fight Victor in the ASC. Then you came to the right place. The bastard came to our doorstep and threatened us. Sent thugs to capture one of our own who came in peace, seeking refuge. There's not a day that goes by that he doesn't grab and gain more power. The time's come to bring Victor down. You not only have me on your side, Mansa, but all of Noctis.
Cotton Valley, here we come. Someone sounds excited. Well, duh, the landscape's drop-dead gorgeous. As for the city, integrating with the valley's natural overhangs and alcoves to avoid using a metal dome, you're genius. It makes me worry about getting fried. And we'll always be strangers there. For now, most mutants don't have an innate hatred for humans. We just need to give them time to heal. Still, we'll never be able to walk a mile in their shoes. And for that, we'll always be outsiders. I ain't mad, though. If I were them, it'd be my personal mission to fuck up every single humanoid who said good day to me. Right now, we must focus on uniting our nation. I understand you find it difficult to feel at home, but know that you are a friend, and that as long as I live here, you will be welcome. And when our people are finally free, I know many of my brothers and sisters will welcome you too. Don't stress out about the roof. You won't be instantly mutated. I have heard tales. Yeah, what a beautiful place. Natural, organic, how refreshing. Humans should take notes. This city makes me sad. You're not gonna cry, are ya? I just had these seats cleaned. I mean, I think I would have liked to, you know, know before of its existence. It's all right. Sad is too grand. Wistful, yes, wistful. By Jove, I've done it. I think we got everything you need. You able to fix the pump now? Yeah, I got this shit on lockdown. Give me the parts. Shouldn't take long. Now that we are at full strength, we must devise a way to compromise Victor's popularity at the Assembly. I've got a lead. There's this grizzled old general who's been bitching about the lack of info he gets about Aurora. Right now, he's the only one with the balls to call Victor the Dictor incompetent. According to him, the Aurora Dowser's down Shit Creek and may have been booted off his post. If we can prove that General is right and isn't just some senile old man... Maybe the army's head honchos will be pissed enough at the colonel to kick his buns in the sun. And we would need hard evidence. I'm almost positive that Dandolo can help us. Nocta sends merchants everywhere, after all. We also have some connections with Technomancers over there. They should be able to tell us what happened. We could try Anton. Aurora's a little far, but there's no place that's safe from Anton's little birds. It's a start. Even if abundance is run from the top down, members of the Assembly would pay attention to uprisings. Some of your local allies can help you stir up some anger in the masses. The ASC has made their lives miserable for months. People are arrested on a whisper, live huddled in fear. It would not take much to spark the powder keg. It's a good idea, but we can't influence entire populations by ourselves. We'd need allies hidden among the people. Back when I was an artist, I got into some altercations with assembly members who thought my shows were blasphemy. Maybe it was because I didn't say hail to the shadow 50 times, I can't say for sure, but if we could get them to think that Victor isn't a devout believer, we could get the large religious sect of the assembly to revoke their support and demand his banishment. Or we could just give them a little nudge in the right direction by making them believe Victor steals relics for his own use. We'd have to stage an elaborate setup, but I like it. After all, the trickster must get what he gives. They'll need volunteers that could pretend to be ASC. The plan is right up Anton's alley. It's possible for Dandolo or the opposition to help us out too. One last thing. 
I was told the High Judge endorses all of Victor's decisions, even though I know for a fact that he hates him. Which is more than a bit strange. The Judge is such an honest man. Or if you're in the mood to make a scandal, I've got everything we need. Did you know that Victor employs young women to worm out information on men he keeps tabs on? And I'm not Victor, but I have a feeling he used that info to blackmail these same men. If we can prove it, the Assembly would have a major meltdown. Their beloved Colonel, a pimp. To find evidence of his trafficking, we could look for the orders he gave his goons. Have you seen his hands? Far too immaculate to be doing this dirty work himself. Avori aren't doing anything about it. He must be profiting from it somehow. This is a dead end. We need to find a new approach. Indeed. How's this? I've heard that a small faction of the Assembly blindly backs up Victor, no matter how crazy the project is. So I believe it uncertain that their chief of this faction was bribed. So unless we bribe him ourselves, we'll have to silence him. It's not ideal, but I have no way of finding out what dirt the ASC has on that man. We'll have to go without his support, and hope we can get enough voters elsewhere. All these ideas will indeed cut off Victor from his support network. But... This is going to sound self-interested, but if we could help the mutants escape from the pen, it would expedite the Colonel's downfall. The people and the Assembly would be outraged to know that after decades of civilized control, Victor was the one who couldn't keep them in check. I'd like to see the Colonel try to justify his mistake of so many slaves, particularly ones notorious for their feeble minds. No, it's not selfish. It's a good plan. We're gonna help mutants in the pen prepare their escape. After a mass breakout like that, his reputation will never be the same. Thank you, all of you, for the ideas. Now let's make them happen. Hi. Zachariah, to what do I owe this privilege? I got your well taken care of. No more creature, and it runs like new. A man of your word. Take this, for your time and help. And if you have more time to help us. A serious matter has come to my attention. Our observers in Ophir report that a mutant group there now faces execution. Punishment for refusing to complete their tasks. Probably fixing the city's shutters. Aurora's attacks blew a hole in Ophir's roof, considering how important it is to get it fixed. Humans hurt other humans and mutants face death. Yes, well, they are being held apart from the rest. They must be saved, Zachariah. I'll do what I can. Can't guarantee anything, though. Your best is better than our nothing. My brothers in Ophir have suffered enough. Greetings, Zachariah. Rumor is Aurora's dowser was deposed. I need to know it's more than rumor, though. If it's true, we might be able to convince some members of the Assembly that Victor needs to go. Even though I don't like the idea of continuing the conflict between Abundance and Aurora, that has caused so much suffering. If it's what needs to be done to dethrone Victor, I have a few contacts among Aurora's Technomancers. They're not quite brothers, but they're at least like cousins. And I've heard their messengers nearly always follow one particular shadow path. Let me show you. This one here. If you go, you may be able to stop one of their couriers. If the news you're expecting is as important as you say, I'm sure it will be in the documents they are carrying. Thanks, Melvin. Zachariah, I've received a message from Dandolo. He has some information on the disappearance of patients. Really? Did he learn where he was taken? The ASC had him locked up in an old dome near Ophir. In his message, he says that it's a dome that Technomancers used to use. Does this sound familiar to you? Hard to forget. Yes. That's where initiations would take place before Amantis destroyed everything. We'll have to go free him. The place must be teeming with soldiers fighting for Victor. But we can't leave the old Technomancer in their hands. 